So we actually see John Walker walking away from the crowd after they witness in horror on him killing one of the flag smashers after he killed <clears throat> Lamar, which he isn't the one who killed him, but it was Kylie. But knowingly what he did, we see Sam and Bucky approach him stating that he should return the shield to them knowingly that he said that he is Captain America but he actually hasn't proven that he is Captain America so that they had to battle him to get the shield in which we seen Bucky got his arm <coughs> smashed However, we see Sam actually put up a fight saying that he knew that retiring the shield doesn't mean anything until we see John remove his wings and then he about to kill him like what he did to the Flag Smashers until Bucky actually stopped him. And with that, he broke his arm and which they've actually knocked him out knowingly they defeated him and so Sam has taken have taken a shield knowingly that we see Bucky trying to track down Simu so we knew that he won't actually go with him to taking the shield where he is going but we see Joaquin actually saw the broken wings knowing that Sam won't need them. However, we actually seen the Flag Smashers see that their camp had been raided after the GRC have accused them of harboring fugitives. So they knew that they're going to vote on the relocation, meaning that they're going to put all these citizens back home but Kali actually knew is what they want so she actually put up a movement on the fact that she doesn't want the GCC to get what they want meanwhile we've seen John Walker has been court-martialed over what happened and in the result the government have stripped him of his title and his authority of Captain America plus all of his retirement plans and budget have been revoked but he actually told them that he actually have proven that he is Captain America but they actually say that he is not so they actually knew that they stripped him of his title as Captain America and they ordered him to to return the shield but knowingly that he doesn't have it we actually see them being approached by <clears throat> Valentina Argina the Fortier in which she actually knew that what he did as Captain America was right but knowingly how she didn't actually didn't ask for the shield because he doesn't have it and she told him that it doesn't belong to the government either so they actually knew what they had to do next but knowingly that he's paying a visit to Lamar's family and they actually are grieving at the fact that Lamar's death is heartbreaking so he knew for his friend that he had to do what is right meanwhile we seen on Sokovia where Simu actually see the memorial that Bucky has found him knowingly that he's about to kill him in which he actually cannot command him to do so as well however he didn't actually shoot because the bullets wasn't loaded until the Dora actually came and took him as well. They take him to the raft where he spent his time there. Meanwhile, we actually see Bucky ask Ayo for another favor in which we seen how they try 
to do so as well. Meanwhile, we see Sam talking to his sister Sarah about the boat, which they knew they cannot sell it, but they actually will do whatever they can to fix the ship. However, we seen Sam going to Isaiah, in which he knew that he had Captain America's shield, but he doesn't want him to uncover it, knowing that Stars and Stripes doesn't mean nothing to him, until he actually heard that he doesn't understand, which makes Isaiah talk about what he experienced, which he told him about a woman that he loved, died before he can get the letters to him but hydra actually stopped the letters of going out to the one woman that he loved but he actually knew that he used his powers to break his men free similar of the reference of the red tails However, they actually experimented on him, knowing that they want to know how this serum works. But there's one nurse who was compassionate enough to take care of him. It was actually her who declared him dead. But we knew that he actually said that a man couldn't actually be Captain America. And by that, he meant a man of his race couldn't be Captain America. But we actually see how Sam tried his best to fix the family's boat. But he actually got a call from friends, and they actually agreed to help him out. Until we actually see Bucky actually appeared to help out as well, which he actually showed him a case for Sam. In which he actually met his sister Sarah, which he actually became friends with really quickly. So we see them actually repairing the boat as well. But now we actually see Sarah say that they cannot sell it because he because she understands what he's going through, which we see them actually practicing with Captain America's shield. In which Bucky said that retiring the shield is the only thing that he actually have left of him. But he actually doesn't have anything left anymore since he did that. But now he actually has his book. But we knew how he's going to keep training with the shield. Which Sam actually continue on. Until he actually got the movements actually right. But we actually see Sharon actually talking to the Baron about, I mean, Barra, about making a deal with the Flag Smashers until they actually was given weapons. Then he actually said that he isn't here to help them with their movements. He's actually here to help kill the Falcon. In which... The summon actually appears, which we actually see one of the, actually two men who were supposed to be the guards actually working for the Flag Smashers. And so they actually locked down the entire facility, which we knew that Sam have opening the case for himself, knowing that he actually got a surprise. But at the end of the episode, we see John Walker building a new shield in which, since he is not Captain America anymore, he'll go by a new name from the Marvel Comics known as the U.S. Agent. So we actually see John Walker being stripped of his title as Captain America while Sam is trading with the shield in hopes of becoming the new Captain America, like in the Marvel comics. However, the Flag Smashers are making their move, trying to prevent the GRC of making the vote <coughs> countable. But we've seen Sam get ready to put on the suit from Bucky, which we've seen John actually making a new shield, and he's going to call himself the U.S. Agent. And so we knew what's going to happen, in which we see the mid-season 
So we're going to see what's going to happen on the mid-season finale next weekend. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment what you think about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr, and my Facebook page. Until then, this is Anime Guys right here saying signing out. Laters, and be safe.